Hi guys, I am just doing a quick update because I finally, um, I think I'm going to upload this video. It was extremely excruciating to make. I had a lot of technical difficulties and I had to start over from scratch. And listening to these guys um, for very long will make your head explode if you're a Christian. And um, so I also was hesitant because some of the information in this, I feel like, oh, is this too much? Is this like too much information about, you know, really weird stuff? But I think it's true. And I think it's important to be somewhat aware. But anyway, I wanted to tell you that following up, I am going to be doing a series that I think is a good um, counteraction to this video with all the um, sewage that comes out of their mouths. I found a uh, blog post by Daryl Giffen, who I have used before, and it's quite lengthy, so I'm breaking it up into a few parts, and it is about the final Gnostic assault from within. So part one is the final Gnostic assault from within. Part two is red flags, which gives you a lot like 30 points of things to be um, aware of, uh, red flags that you might see in the in the Christian church, things that are taught and said and attitudes and different things. And then there is destroyed foundations the word and lastly part four and it might be two parts the quantum world view and new age laughter so i thought this um blog post was a really good um way to follow up this this video it explains what gnosticism is and it shows how it is showing up in the church and this uh this video that i did here this is not church people but they are influencing people in the church through Reawaken America and the letter after P and things like that, which is in the church. So also, I almost forgot. I am also uploading this video, which is an article by Trisha Tillen about Constance Cumbie and did an interview about how the letter after P and the manifest sons of God are the same thing. I uploaded this last year, including the interview, which got me a strike. So I took all that out. I hope this flies. Um, thanks for watching this short update or whatever. It's not really a channel update. I just wanted to explain um, so that you know the next few videos after this one are this article or series of articles and it's me reading. It's not clippy. It's just learning. It's education. And thank you for watching. Run. There's just one name that can keep you out of hell. And it's the name of Jesus. The name of Jesus. Jesus!